we are in a race against time to adapt to a rapidly changing climate. To put it simply, the state of the planet is broken. How can we engage the entrepreneurial force, not only of large enterprises, but of new startups, of young people? We need all hands on deck to build back after the COVID-19 pandemic. And the greatest untapped resource that we have is what's in every person's head. The only way to reach the UN SDGs by 2030 is to approach these persistent societal challenges in new ways. Uplink is a perfect platform for this because it brings together in one place social entrepreneurs, businesses and the public who can combine their efforts. We need business and government. We need civil society. We need all citizens working together. And when we do, we can all be platforms for change. And that's why I'm so excited about Uplink. Young people in particular are very much disadvantaged when it comes to accessing a network. Uplink actually gives them a space to present their ideas and link up with mentors and networks that they might otherwise not have achieved. We're exploring how we can unite art, science, and local communities to accelerate marine restoration. Madiba Nature is a non-profit organization based in Cameroon with the aim to tackle the marine plastic waste. I started SUGI to bring the wisdom of the ancient forest back in the midst of urban life. Portolio help researchers find cures and treatments that they wouldn't have otherwise been able to find. We've developed a technology that can take seawater, convert it into drinking water through the photons of the sun. We all could be tremendous platforms for change. We all could imagine a better, safer, healthier, more equitable, more sustainable world. We can do it together. We can find each other. We can connect. We can create. We can invest, we can grow, and we can achieve with Uplink. Uplink is a unique tool to improve the state of the world. The door is open, the solutions are there. Now is the time to transform humankind's relationship with the natural world and with each other. And we must do so together.